My father was actually a Satanist high priest, so he um, did all kinds of evil things. They say, you are a wise man. You remind them that Walter Sisulu was a wise man too. They say, you lose warmth and charm. Something strange is going on which has multiple layers of information and disinformation in the mainstream media. We must ask the question of what is really revealing itself in this untouchable world of the elite's power struggle in which we are spectators to. We need to decide how it is going to affect us, the generations of our children after us, and what we are going to do about it. Confronting the hard questions and exploring the vastly unexplained incidences throughout our history has instigated massive shifts in our paradigm of thought and cultural understandings of the events we have been told are too taboo to talk about. We must address the physical, metaphysical, psychological and spiritual aspect of our true history. We must ask how much science is being used to instigate and explain these incidences and to ask ourselves is this all really just another layer of an ever increasingly elaborate dark Illuminati hoax. The world elite reminds most people of a group of rich folk who entertain themselves with fancy parties and horse races. But is it something else entirely? Are we being fooled into believing that the Illuminati control the world. In the beginning was the word, the word was sound. So what you're looking at here is merely particles formed into patterns by sound. Um, they were all over the place to start with, just in random positions on the plate. As soon as the sound appears, they form into these patterns because um, everything is sound. And it is sound that turns uh, matter and energy into form. Have we been hoaxed into thinking we are in the end times? Get ready to read all these words on this page without making a mistake. Look at the letter at the end and remember the sound it makes. Get ready, pound. Yes, kite. Get ready to read this word the fast way. Get ready, king. Yes, kick. Sound it out. Get ready. Sound it out. Get ready. Kick. What word? Kick. Yes, kick. Boys and girls, sound this word out. Get ready. Steal. What word? Steal. Yes, steal. Read these words the fast way. Get ready. Play. Yes, play. Get ready. Must. Yes, must. Let's read these words the fast way without making a mistake. Get ready. Kite. Yes, kite. Get ready. Kick. Yes, kick. Get ready. Steal. Yes, steal. Get ready. Play. Yes, play. Get ready. Must. Yes, must. Well, you guys speak the reading up from under your seat. Open your book up to lesson 60 on page 153. <laughs> Are the Illuminati the key that unlocks the secrets surrounding the events that Christians call tribulation, rapture, days of sorrow, and the end times? Hear me and make all spirits subject unto me, so that every spirit of the firmament and of the aether, upon the earth and under the earth, on dry land and in the waters, of whirling air and of rushing fire, and every spell and scourge of God may be obedient unto me. Have the ancient mysteries from the days of Babylon resurfaced to fulfill magical prophecies proving religion has been engineered by wise sages of the past in order to maintain social control throughout the ages? The Prince of Earth brings the blessing of heaven the golden seminal sacrament of life unto the celebrants of its ancient rites. And such is the mystery of the Holy Grail.
This photo shows the beautifully formed geometric design of the Yushi Spring water. This next photo is from the Shimanto River, the last clean spring in Japan. Notice the extraordinary geometric forms. The fact that the molecular structure of water can be affected by our consciousness, our intent, and our sounds is extremely important. The elite, that is the part of the elite that call themselves the Illuminati, the enlightened ones, contained at the heart 13 incredibly rich Zionist families that are in constant contact with each other. Say, hey, uh, we're discussing business ethics. Yes, no wonder we couldn't hear anything over here. Many of us that weren't total witches have to be witches now in order to produce music. The master is a tape about as big as the top of this podium that looks like an overgrown 8-track that the album is cut on and is placed in a machine that produces and presses the records and the 8-tracks and cassettes that you buy. After it's been recorded, it's taken in. This is why a master is cut months in advance before it's released. On the full moon, it's taken in to a temple room about the size of this auditorium that is in every one of the major music companies behind locked doors up in the executive offices and it's placed on an altar setting in the north of the room and a pentagram engraved in the floor and 13 hand chosen witches and a coven come in and conjure a principality or a power up usually Regia or something like that and order him to tell the demons under him to follow every record and every tape coming off of that master. As I tell many Christian parents, you can go home and count your kids' records, probably yours too, and count how many demons at least are there. If that's too hard for you to believe, I'm sorry. That's why they do it. Is the music and television industry hosting ancient rituals live to the world through elaborate stages, broadcasting magic rituals into the sacred realm of your own home? In this photo, we can compare the contaminated water with clean stream water. Look at the difference. We can compare the effects of healing versus heavy metal music and what happens to the water molecules. And here we can compare the effects of thank you with the you make me sick, I will kill you. Very, very different geometric forms being incurred through the intention. And in this photo we can compare the toxic water and then the effects of praying over the water. It's really quite impressive. These photographs that we have just seen show proof that not only does sound have the ability of affecting and changing physical structure, but that with regard to the molecular structure of water, that our intent with our sound is extremely important. This may have great implications for the future of both personal and planetary harmony and healing.